Hi Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Mars and Venus. This is going to be your timeless terror reading. This is going to be a general reading also. And, you know, looking at your spread, I feel as if you may have been in the energy of, you know, feeling a lot of fear, maybe feeling a lot of fear around expressing who you really are. And I feel like it's, it's a projection from others. I don't really feel like it's your fear because you know that you have the gifts and talents and attributes, you know, to succeed in life and to succeed in whatever field that you are called to do. And I feel like you could be, for some of you, in the public eye or you do gain a lot of attention. Um, this could be on social media for some of you or wherever you go, whether that's in work, whether that's because I'm looking at the star card and I'm looking at the moon card. Some of you could be connecting with someone that is a Aquarius Pisces cusp. And this person, if you don't know who this person is, they don't have to be. But I feel like there's a lot of eyes on you. A lot of people are fixated on you. And with that comes, you know, a lot of projections that is placed upon you, whether you realize that or not. And I'm hearing psychic attacks as well. So, you you know, spirit is guiding you, Libra, to be quite mindful of your energy, who, you're, who you share your energy with, um, and maybe just, you know, monitoring your social media. I mean, you can't really you know, choose who, what, who looks at you, you know. Um, it's like a famous person saying, I don't want all eyes to be, you know, looking at me. When they got, like, millions of followers on Instagram say, you, you can't, you know, control that. But I feel like you do have um, a lot of eyes on you. Some people, yes, they're for you. Some people, not so much. So there's a lot of projection um, that you could be embodying. So if you're feeling in the energies of, of feeling quite fearful, especially in regards to expressing yourself, then that may not be coming from you. So Spirit is saying that maybe you may need to cleanse yourself. You may need to have a salted bath. You may need to meditate. You may need to put up a protective barrier around you you know, of protection, because there is a lot of people that are, you know, fixated on you, and some of these fixations are not for the good, it's almost as if people want to see what you're going to do next, but at the same time, they don't want you to really express yourself, they want to keep you in a stuck and stagnant energy, and these people could belong to the same club, group, organisation, or team that you belong to, and I feel like these people are quite fearful of you you expanding, of your expansion, because I'm looking at the, the hangman and the high priestess. So there's definitely a Pisces here that is very fixated on you, very fixated and concerned about your growth is what I'm picking up. You could be in the same area of work as this person and they're fearful of your come up. They're fearful of your glow up. They're fearful of your power staring at the queen of wands right now so this is an indication of this person not wanting you to know your power and below the queen of wands we have the four of pentacles and with the four of pentacles the man's holding tightly onto the pentacles so this could also be someone that is um i'm hearing love interest this could be like an ex-partner that doesn't want to let you go for some of you i feel more so that it's it's somebody that you could work with, you could be in the same area of work with, this person likes to stay behind the scenes however, and you may have had a lot of love for this individual in the past, there's someone here with the king of cups card that could want to come back in, I'm hearing, who's this king of cups, there's someone that you ended things with as well, king of cups is my Scorpio energy, and below the king of cups we have the death card, so it was someone that you ended things with a long time ago, and this person does want to come back in, and I feel, you know, Spirit is saying that this individual slows you down. Whoever this King of Cups person is, whoever this Scorpio person is, they slow you down. And, you know, by you being around this individual Libra, you know, whether this person is conscious or unconscious of it, energetically, they keep you stuck and they keep you stagnant. It's almost as if they sway you off path. And and that's not just this, I don't know who this person is, it could be a ex-person, ex-partner, it could be this person that is fixated on you, I feel they're two separate entities for some of you, but, you know, for some of you, Spirit is saying to, if you ended things with this person, Spirit is saying to keep that, that thing ended, that situation ended, because you are evolving, and for some of you, this person doesn't want you to evolve, and for others of you, 